At running back, Georgia's Elijah Holyfield will be an intriguing name to watch. The son of boxing great Evander Holyfield, Elijah's put a lot of time in the weight room to build his powerful frame. My dad told me, he said, uh, you can work out with me. He had, he had a trainer that used to come to his house, and I stayed with him that year, and uh, we worked out every morning before school. And ever since then, it's been kind of like ingrained in me. You know, it's almost become a habit. If I don't work out, I start feeling weird. You know, I go a couple of days without working out, I start feeling weird. I start getting anxious and stuff. It's, it's a good habit to have, so I feel like it's helped me a lot. All of a sudden, you know, he love working out. You know, he don't take shortcuts. He likes sweat. You know, and is and, and, and very structured. And, and out of all, all my kids, here's one that, Daddy, can I run with you? Can I do this? He, he wanted to lift weights. He wanted to do all the things. You know, the other kids, I had that. I said, man, come on, look, come on down. This is what you have to do. But he was just one of the ones that love hard work. Elijah proved capable of handling a heavy workload at Woodward Academy in Georgia. There was one situation in particular last year. We were playing a game, we got behind against Lovett, and uh, I got frustrated with my quarterback play, and I, and I made a decision. I said, we're gonna, we're gonna lose the game, we're gonna lose it, giving it to our best player. And lo and behold, I think at the end of the day, I think he to toted the ball about 38 times, and not once did he tap his helmet and say, Coach, I need a, a playoff. Yeah, I do remember that game. Uh pretty vividly, I got the ball 24 straight time. And uh, I would say that's one of the most tired I've ever been in my life. Um, and, but I, I know I just kept thinking about, you know, all the hard work and uh, working out I've done over the, you know, over the summer. And I feel like it helped me get through that. While Holyfield may lack the top end speed of some other backs in the draft, he's a physical ball carrier who can take a lot of punishment and has sure to entice some team to grab him on the third day of the draft.